Hi, I'm Sander Rajeste. I am Tadej Sedekerskis. And this is our random interview. Each number on the dice represents a different interview topic. So the dice will decide what we'll talk about. Let's go. <sighs> oh. Five. Spain. If you could change one thing about Spain, what would it be and why? Maybe the only change I would make is that all my friends and family would also live here. <laughs> That's the main thing I think I miss about uh, Estonia. I don't know, what do you think? Not a lot of people speak English here. Yeah, that's true, that's a big thing. So, yeah. like, it's not a problem for us because yeah. we're <laughs> for so long here, so we know the language, but yeah. for the other guys who are coming, it's... Uh, yeah, that would definitely be help, helpful. Yeah. Yes. Let's get something different. Ooh, six. Please tell me a joke. Actually, I don't really know uh, a lot of jokes, but this question reminds me of, of Danny Diaz. <laughs> because <laughs> every day he would go and with his Spanish accent. Good yolk, eh? Good yolk. <laughs> Good yolk. It's a yolk, guys. It's a yolk. <laughs> it's a yolk, it's a yolk, it's a yolk, don't worry. Uh, topic three, home. Who was your EuroLeague hero when you were growing up? I saw all the greats, you know, who were playing at uh, when when I was younger, you know, Diamantidis, all these guys. But uh, for me, the the guy I watched was Christian Kangur when he was playing. He was here for a little bit. He was playing with uh, with Siena Montepaschi. So it was like the, our only guy in uh, in Euroleague at that time. So that was something you could look like, hey, he's like from the same small country as me, you know, yes. maybe I can also make it. You have a big basketball co culture in, in Lithuania. I don't know who was your like uh, big example Yeah, for in sure. I'm like since young age, I, I, I was watching especially Zalgiris games and uh, we had a lot of legends playing. I remember uh, with Maccabi when they had the uh, Crazy squad, also Sabonis. Or Sabonis. <laughs> when, he, when he came back after the NBA, yeah. the last season with Jalgiris. Yeah, let's get two. I never had two. No. Oh, two. Topic number two: teammates. If you were in trouble, which teammate would you call first, and why? You don't have to say me. Because I'm pretty useless. <laughs> I would call either Rokas or you because uh, Rokas from my country, or you, because you know the city, you know the... you have to do your contacts. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, that's a one. How do you feel season is going so far? I think we started really good. We definitely showed that uh, we're a serious team, you know? Yeah, um, I think like... A lot of basketball specialists yeah, start like in the are, list. Yes, they definitely an under, under, team, yeah, you know, underestimated us. Team. Uh, exactly. It's nice to start well, to take that confidence. But also, the season is super long. So far, we're doing pretty good yeah. job. So we just have to keep it up. And this was our random interview. <laughs> that was our random interview. We I done. hope you enjoyed. <laughs> <laughs>